Here I think I'm doing all right with volume balance. Then I re-listen to whenever I'm talking low during the I got a new form bit. Not doing too hot. Speaking of not doing too hot, our stats have certainly looked better. I plan on backtracking out of here, but it would be good to find the way forward first. Oh, also we got ourselves a happy little end table, and we got a few moxie points there. Not many. But enough to establish a clean getaway if need be. So we came in from the left of here. Let's go right. Take the ladder. That takes us back here. With some much needed health and a moxie. Hello. Nothing new for you to say. You have a new hole that you want to dig, but you're not digging right now. Access these tabs. That does take me back. Neat. Good. I did want to go back. Hope you poke our heads into town here. Heal up. Perhaps do a bit of vending. Uh, let's buy some supplies. Looks like the most I can have of something is 10. Nah, I'm not gonna bother putting money in the bank. See ya. Let's blow it all. On supplies. A quick check at Cloud Hill. See if there's anything involving that weight. Body hell. And we'll finish up Giant Garden, and we'll proceed into the Wilted Lands, or whatever. It shouldn't take too long. Especially since I can avoid combats. Though I did want to check to see whether these critters had anything to steal, huh? I'm pretty sure all the clouds don't, though. We've encountered most of... Ah, right, he finished the wall. But there is a way over. Besides just reappearing on the other side. Not guard, you don't. Imagine goon, dammit. Yo, Wendy, you got anything for me? Thought I'd check. Alright, good. Good, four dollars. We will enjoy them. That four-ton weight, I, again, like, I just thought it'd be worth checking, you know? Oh, there it is. It did fall on something. Good! Good, good. I'm not foolish yet. Paid attention to context clues and something. Look at me. Marvelous coin. Now, can I... Oh, it crushed his statue! <laughs> okay, I can't do anything with it, but it crushed his statue. I guess that was worth saying. I guess. Eddie, do you have anything? Nah. It makes sense the clouds wouldn't have anything meaningful for me to snatch, other than those conjoined twins. Straight out of that basket case horror movie. Alright, let's go grab that toy chest that's up in the far north, then. And then Boogie. Yeah. I am delighted, though, that it crushed his statue. It looks like we'll be coming back here again later, though. When we have some other features. Like an ability to cross this gap. You're still hanging out there. I don't think I can do anything with you at this time.
Out of my face, Puff. Give me your two dollars. Yep, we already opened that up there. We can shake those for health and moxie. Alright, here we go. This is what I came all the way back here for. What's in the box? A rose shirt. 2% hit point regen. Hmm. Well, considering Jimmy's stats, that probably does better on him. 21 in 19 versus 24 in 17, yeah. Although he has fewer hit points than Buck, and so he doesn't benefit from a 2% all that much. Still better to have that stuff on him. We didn't pick up any new trinkets? No, we didn't. Okay. Cool. Oh, glad I checked. Oh, wait. I don't know how useful that rose shirt is in the grand scheme of things, but I mean, we can always just sell it. Pretty sure there was a sell option at the store. Alright, back to the giant garden. So that's where that goes. Where does this go? To a fight. We'll take this fight, sure. Turn into a goon here. The point in trying to go for a 16 ish percent chance steal right now. Not enough damage, you'll split apart. You'll be fully healed. Heal that startler. And you too. Another marvelous coin. What the hell are these all about? Like special items? Worth approximately zero dollars. What a prize. What a prize. Well, that's the way out of here. Narrowing my brows again. At least I made it through. I don't think that's all to see there, though. Let's see, we took these ladders. Where does this one go? Remind me. Over here. That's right. There was like that light bulb or something that was down somewhere. Take his money. Just attack the skitter. Mortimer upset at us for a that's taking his money, as one does, I understand. Ladder 7 here takes us to... No, we don't want to be here at all. Hold on. I've changed the resolution of my game to be at its tiniest, like, base... Base baby resolution. Curious to see whether that, like, the little hang-ups and freezes I have was just a result of the resolution. That is hard for me to see, though, that's for sure. Alright, we can't trust them, buddy bees. Buck gets the two attacks there. Nicely done, Buck. Oh yeah, the graphics look crisper, it's understandable, since they're not being stretched out like that, and there's no scrolling issues at all. Well, I'll compromise, then, by choosing the second resolution. Shouldn't really be any changes you folks are seeing on your screen. A great tragedy will scar the hardest smile. Some minor lag in the movement. I think it's tolerable. Um, and that hole, I guess, will be the one that's dug eventually.
The other thing that I didn't explore, and there was like a number six one there, was uh, through that eyeball garden. Yeah, here we go. Let's take his bucks. Kill the skitter. Jimmy being attacked quite a bit here. At least he's got that little bit of regen. Is it worth it to high-five yourself? Probably not when I could just feed you a... ant on a log. Yeah, I'll just feed you. A protein meal. Where did this go? Here. Okay. Yeah, I know where that was. Oh, south of the bee garden. You bastards. Speaking of buddy bees. You stupid buddy bees. We weren't directed towards this cave at all. Buck's now level 5. Good. About how I feel. Good talk. Think I'll keep the thug out? He does have that clean getaway ability. Also some stealing potential, I guess. Alright, we're not going that way. Hi. They're the turtles. They emerge from the darkness there. Nice crit, Jimmy. Unnecessary, superfluous, one would even say. We just had even more spook. Did I push that? Couldn't tell. It's bully. Did not get a kill there. Nicely done, Buck. The destroyer. Alright, that's our new skill, our bully skill, that we can take with us wherever we want to go now. Yeah, I actually keep, want to keep stealing the ten bucks, so we'll keep things as they are here. Alright, good. The world's brighter. Hi. Nothing to steal. We're gonna become a blob then. Because I want to start working on leveling that up. Okay. Fucking bad weather. Obnoxious. Jimmy's now level 5. Go ahead and feed Buck. Some ants on a log. Hmm. Nothing of interest over there. Hmm. It narrows his eyes suspiciously. Time to feel underemployed again. Ah, yes. That's the skitter.
Liking the ambiance of the game here. Looks good. Feels good. Although we are in spook land right now. Got darker again. These damn glowing eye turtles. I tell you what. Maybe Buck will get a kill on that one this time. Nah. I think he even did less damage. Feeling self conscious. I don't mind fighting those two, though. Gives me a total of 20 bucks. Allow me to buy more little knickknacks and items, especially after that spending spree I went on earlier. Still, we'll buy. Pass. That. Bite. And that, too. Sure. Hmm. Okay, I can't grab those. That's something I can interact with. Decided to try and summon a fight there, I know better. Again, I went to level this up to level 5 anyway, though, so... As one does. Let's keep going. Alright, mandatory fight. That's bad weather there. Thought I might be able to beat it first to the... The startle fest. But... It has us beat. It's an obnoxious enemy. Kills a lot of damage. Has a startle of everyone. Did not mean to use that on Buck. No matter. Skitter in that turtle. It's a two buck turtle. A spider web. Plus four attack, plus three magic attack. Magic attack, I guess, would help Jimmy. Buck doesn't have any magic attacks. It said Buck's always the one who's attacking, for sure. Slows. Sticky. Means that one of the revolting blob's abilities to, like, make enemies sticky is useless in that situation. Okay. Plus eight. Uh, let's go ahead and slap this on Jimmy, I guess. We'll let go of the butterfly now. It's 28 attack versus 29 attack. Jimmy not that much further behind Buck now. That doesn't look eerie. Great. Just rolled my eyes. Oh good, didn't startle everyone in the universe. Appreciate it, bad weather. Doesn't look like I can do anything with that. Hmm. Alright, that's the way back out. I guess this is a thing that we can remember to see later if we find a thing to deal with the spider web. Blocking a doorway. Or probably an optional boss or a new path or something. Whatever. That was alright, wasn't bad.
Cool. We got a new weapon out of it, at least. And we got a bunch of money. Alright, on the other side of this giant garden, we have... The Wilted Lands. We also have... Clubhouse. music here. We have an ATM to bank at here. And I guess we have places to put our furniture if we had any. We do have this happy little end table. Yay! Plus three magic attack. The only thing we got, though. Guess it's time to buy some furniture, then. Maybe steal some. Let's head back to Smile. We do have some more money, so let's do a bit more vending, yeah? Especially since we have a place to put that furniture now. We got eight slots, it looks like. Plenty of opportunities. As a matter of fact, you can get me some stuff. Yes, 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 yes. Buy me... I'll buy me a windmill. I'll buy me some barrels. Buy some more antelope log. Buy five more Chaco Colas in case I need the um, the Moxie points. All of the vitamins. And two more alarm clocks. Great. We could sell stuff, too. We don't need this pop gun anymore. Two bucks. Fingerless gloves. And this butterfly net that we just bought recently. Uh, we'll get rid of that, too. Eight dollars. Jonathan Bear shirt. The workout clothes. And those overalls. Sure. Alright, that allows me to buy one more thing, or a few more things. Let's grab three more emergency exits. Great. Slot our new furniture into our clubhouse, our swanky, sweet, cool clubhouse. Their commons. Got ourselves a windmill, and we got ourselves some barrels. We got two fourths of the rustic set. We'll deposit our two dollars. What bounty? All right. Well, I guess next time then we're off to the wilted lands. As wilted they may be, and it, there certainly is an appearance disparity between the two. I'll talk to you later.